wooden utensils and cutting boards. In the heart of the home, the kitchen, wooden utensils, and cutting boards symbolize tradition and natural beauty. Their warm tones and sturdy build make them indispensable allies in the art of cooking. Yet, the dishwasher, a titan of convenience, poses a threat to their longevity and grace. The scalding heat and fierce water jets designed to blast away food remnants can be too harsh for the delicate fibers of wood. Exposure to such conditions can lead to a sad fate for your woodenware. Spoons that once stirred lovingly can become twisted and bent, and cutting boards that provided a firm base for slicing and dicing may develop deep cracks or, worse, split in two, becoming a canvas of ruin rather than culinary creation. To preserve these wooden treasures, a gentle hand wash with mild soap and a caress of warm water is sufficient. This tender care cleanses them without the brutality of a dishwasher's environment. And post-wash care is just as critical. Drying them thoroughly is a step that cannot be skipped. Left damp, wood can become a host to unwanted mold or mildew, turning it from an asset to a hazard in your kitchen. Taking the time to hand dry or air dry your wooden tools will ensure they remain safe, clean, and beautiful for countless future meals. Embrace this ritual, and your wooden utensils and cutting boards will serve you faithfully, meal after meal. What is the main reason wooden utensils and cutting boards should not be put in the dishwasher? A. The dishwasher can cause them to lose their color. B. The intense heat and water can warp, crack, or split the wood. What is the recommended method for cleaning wooden utensils and cutting boards? A. Gentle hand wash with mild soap and warm water. B. Soaking in hot water and bleach. Why is it important to thoroughly dry wooden utensils and cutting boards after washing? A. To prevent the growth of mold or mildew. B. To make them shiny.